بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم سبجیکٹ سائنس گریٹ فائف چپٹر نمبر سیون ویدر پیٹرنز لیسن نمبر تری سویر سٹارمز پیج نمبر فور ہنڈرڈ اینڈ ون سو دا وکیبری ورڈ دیٹ وی ڈیل ٹو ڈی نمبر ون سٹارم سرچ سائیکلونز ہاو آر سٹارمز ٹریکٹ سٹارم سرچ ہرکین winds whip up large waves in the ocean so you can see that here if in this figure these are the winds that move in this way okay so the water in the ocean what they do they whip it and where they go they start move in upward so you can see easily from this side cause a bulge of water in the ocean known as a storm move over a coast so you can say that the water is coming out from the ocean on the surface of uh, nearby the places where a coast the storm surge can cause water level to suddenly rise or surge level meters several meters so you can see here first the mean low then mean sea level and here the high tide so you can see the buildings level here it can come and the sea wall will be here but it cross the sea wall and this water enter to the population or can draw, uh, destroy the buildings hurricane danger include flying objects strong winds and floodings if possible level areas threatened by a hurricane if you have to stay in the area board up windows and stay away from windows and door store food bottled water flashlights and battery operated radios why because these things may be you use during this condition if you have these kinds of things some eating stuff with you like water for lightning maybe at the night you need light so operating radios you can hear the news from the official authorities you so you should keep this thing with you stay away from beaches and areas that may become flooded be prepared to leave the area if authorities advise you to do so so just wait for the message or the signal from your authorities and they advise you you should do according to their advices cyclone any storm with a low pressure center that cause a circular pattern of wind to form is called cyclone so we already know about the cyclone what are the cyclone in which the air move in circular path okay in circular motion you can say that so these cause the cyclone so here it's moving upward in this way started down and it start to move the air in this way so these are the cyclones so tropical storms hurricanes and tornadoes have low pressure center and spinning winds they are all cyclones so here is one of the example of cyclone in which air move and destroy the things how are storms track it tells you here how can you know or identify or track the storm now it will be storm here so what the method you adopt to know about this meteorologists use different kinds of instrument to collect data about the variable that can affect a storm before storm there are many changes occur so the meteorologists first detect uh, with the help of instrument these kinds of changes weather situations around the world use 
instruments such as weather vane, barometers, and rain gauge to gather data about local weather conditions. So, if you have the data, you know that what will be the condition of the weather outside. Many local weather stations have Doppler radar. This radar is look like in this way, okay. It has lot of, you can say that the detector in it, what they do, they track the speed and direction of wind and rain by measuring changes in the motion of an object as the object move towards or away from the radar detector. So, here it has a specific type of object if it move towards or away in this way it can collect the data and then the meteorologist gather the data and inform us about the condition. Scientists choose weather balloons to gather data about weather conditions in the upper atmosphere. So, they use these kinds of balloon which already attach different types of transmitters or you can say that the detectors with them. The instrument in the balloon use radio transmitters to send air pressure, temperature and humidity data back to the ground station. By monitoring the balloon's movement, meteorologists gather data about the wind at its attitude. So, as high as it can go here the in the atmosphere, it can uh, gather the data and inform the meteorologist. Weather satellites take picture of the atmosphere from space. So, these are the satellites that you can say that in the space, it take the picture from the space of the heat of the ground and the ocean from both not only for the ground, but also for on the uh, ocean. Another type of camera take pictures of cloud cover and can track the size and the location of the hurricane. So, it can tell you here whatever about the condition from the surface of uh, ground and on the ocean the condition of the clouds. Satellites photos can not tell the wind speed. If a hurricane meteorologist fly into hurricanes and drop instruments to collect this data because satellites just take the picture it can't tell you about the speed by gathering accurate information about the wind speed and pressure meteorologists are better able to predict the weather of a uh, sorry the predict the path of the hurricane thanks for watching